I'd like to begin by acknowledging that tonight we are filming in Mission BC on the unceded traditional lands of the Lakamel, Sumas, Matsqui First Nations. I'd like to also acknowledge all those who have participated putting tonight's event together and those of you who are participating gathered uh, abroad. The best part about Christmas is really spending time together with the people that are most important to us in our lives. And it's remarkable that we can all be gathered together tonight thanks to modern technology to celebrate together. The Academy Awards Night has been a tradition of Meridian for the last 15 years. And tonight, once again, it's a pleasure to honor all of you. And when I say all of you, I mean the over 400 Meridianites. Over 400 people who have gone through another strange and unusual year. The continuance of the pandemic, supply chain shortages, staff shortages, and the effects of the most recent natural disaster we've experienced. Times have been challenging, but through it all, you've been positive, you've been bound together, and you've been resilient. I'm kind of a lover of those cheesy Christmas movies that we sometimes watch. And one of the ones I like is called Scrooged with Bill Murray. And Bill, he gives this speech that's a little erratic and crazy near the end of the film, and it goes like this. He says, it's Christmas Eve. It's the one night of the year when we'll all act a little nicer. We smile a little easier. We cheer a little more. For a couple of hours out of the whole year, we're the people that we always hoped we would be. It's a miracle. And I want to say that at Meridian, that miracle's happening all the time. Like every day. Like the savior of the world whose life we celebrate this time of year. You bear one another's burdens. You lift each other up. And you serve tirelessly. You love. You have compassion. And those values, they resonate with all of mankind, everybody, regardless of background, regardless of faith, regardless of circumstances. Tonight, it's all about celebrating and honoring you and the miracle that you bring to Meridian every day. So let's kick off this event, people. Let's start 15th Annual Awards. This year, we had 176 votes come in. To be nominated for any award is an honor all to itself. I want to congratulate all of the nominees and best of luck tonight. This year, each winner of an Academy Award will receive an additional $100 on their paycheck. Also, the highly coveted trophy for their Academy Award will be theirs to keep. So to get things started, I'd like to turn it over to the North Vancouver store who will be introducing the Rookie of the Year Award. The Rookie of the Year Award recognizes top performing rising stars in their first year with Meridian. These individuals strive for high achievements and personify our core values. The nominees for Rookie of the Year this year are... Cody Cormack, Rebecca Redmond, Scott Williams, Jennifer Sandoval, Hiva Shahidian, Nicholas Blaine, Ava Gilbertson, Riley Job, and Angus Calder. And the winner is Rebecca Redmond. Congratulations. Congratulations, Rebecca. One of Rebecca's co workers actually said, Rebecca was hired in February, and she has the best work ethic that I've ever seen. Next award is going to be the Meat Cutter Extraordinaire. Now, before we get to the award, I think it would be best if we look at some of the achievements that our meat cutters have got this year. For level one meat cutting achievements, Joshua Smith, Ryan Charles, Emma Hudson, Kaylin Sabuliak, 
Kyle Smith, Elena Raymond, Stephanie Schroeder, Kaylee Dollywall, Adam Fun. Level two meat cutting achievements, Carissa Hazelwood, Alex Ray, and Jenna Gunnerson. And to introduce this year's award, we'll go to Peninsula with Jenna Gunnerson. Meridian's history began in the meat business, and this continues to be an area we specialize in today. Thanks to the talented individuals, journeymen, and apprentices in our company, striving daily to perfect the skills in the art of meat craft. The Meat Cutter Extraordinaire Award recognizes those who stand a cut above in their honor, technique, and expertise. This year's nominees are Dave Elliott Slack, Kyle Smith, Elena Raymond, Kaylin Sabuliak, Emma Hudson, Jeffrey Utzendarp, Ryan Charles, Stephanie Schroeder. And the winner is Kyle Smith from Maple Ridge. Congratulations, Kyle. You know, one of Kyle's co-workers said that a New York steak cut by Kyle is a blessing to the taste buds. I'm now going to turn the time over to Sean Sadu at our mission location. He's going to introduce the Team Player Award. They say coming together is the beginning, keeping together is progress, and working together is success. It's teamwork that makes the dream work. The Team Player Award honors those who have extraordinary integrity, commitment, and support for their fellow team members. This year's nominees for the Team Player Award are... Chris Anktel, Kiyomi Russell, Emily Handy, Samantha Bond, Eli Ranger, Donald Ross, Andrew Gerges, Cole Dunn, and Samuel Beeksma. And the winner is... Donald Ross. Congratulations, Donald. Hey, congratulations, Donnie. One of your coworkers said she can't get over just how kind you are to everybody and how you'll do anything to help other coworkers. When Meridian opened its doors over 30 years ago, people came from far and wide to try the fresh meats and seafood. But really, it was the special service they received and the feelings that they felt that kept them coming back. Barb Milne, our aunt, she was there from day one. And she treated every customer like a friend. She got them to know them on a very personalized level, getting to know them by name, and even getting to know their family members. She would serve them with love and kindness, and she would laugh with them, even cry with some. But she served them all and loved them until her passing in 2003. The Barb Mellon Award was created in her honor and to recognize those that give the same kind of personalized, extraordinary service she did. This year's nominees for the Barb Mellon Award are Sean Lewis, Brian Candy, Kiyomi Russell, Austin Rebalkin, Regan Peters, Mary Joy Nicholas, Joan English, Diane Liverington, Austin Raponi, and Naya Westingham. And this year's recipient of the Barb Milne Award is Diane Leverington. Congratulations. Some of our team members actually said about Diane, she has a way of making every customer smile. All the customers love her. She's even had children bring her drawings. Our next award is the Innovation Award. Now we're going to go over to POCO where Shannon is going to introduce. In business they say you must innovate or die. Failure to innovate has led to the demise of some companies while those who embrace innovation create ongoing opportunities to improve, grow, and thrive. The Innovation Award acknowledges our Meridian core value to find better ways of doing things and celebrates those among us who contrib contributes new ideas, methods, products, and other innovations. 
This year's nominees for the Innovation Award are Ed Wassenaar, Bryn Peck, Holly Dershin, Gabrielle Garifalo, Zachary Parks, Angela Vassone, Corey Innes, Carissa Hazelwood, Jake Taylor, and Katherine Anderson. And this year's winner of the Innovation Award is Jake Taylor from South Surrey. Congratulations, Jake. One of your coworkers said that you embody the Meridian core value to find better ways of doing things. Keep up the great work. We'd now like to turn the time over to our Ralph store for the next part of our presentation. Hi, I'm Annika from Ralph's. I'm a shift manager and meat cutter here. So as a part of the Academy Awards, we would like to recognize everyone that has um, been here for such a long time. A couple people have been here for around five years. Someone actually just got her 30 year. Um, she, without them, Meridian would not be what it is today. So if you ever see any of them, be sure to give them a really big congratulations and wish them all the best. The employees who have achieved their five year milestone are Marianne McFarlane, Doug Evans, Daniel Engel, Denise Crawford, Carrie Griffin, Jared Hillman, David Chen, Nolene McHugh, Kyle Watson, Andrew Gerges, Catherine Anderson, Austin Raponi, Chris Anktel, Kate Jewell, Kelsey Wellard, and Alex Ray. Each of those employees will be receiving a $500 bonus on their next paycheck. In addition, Julie Strauss has reached her 30-year milestone with the company. Thank you so much, Julie, for the time, hard work, and dedication you've given to the building up of Ralph's and Meridian. As a result of reaching this milestone, you'll be receiving an additional $1,000 on your next paycheck. Our next award is the Best Presentation Award, and for that, we'll take you over to Mateo at the Maple Ridge store. In our business, customers eat with their eyes before they buy. So it's our challenge to make our food look as delicious and visually appealing as possible. There are some of us who really excel at presentation. This year's nominees for best presentation are Jeffrey Mallow, Caitlin Isaac, Carrie Griffin, Nicole LeClaire, Harleen Singh, Abigail Forrester, Diane Redekop, Francesca Barata, Katherine Anderson. And the winner is Jeff Mallow from Head Office. Congratulations, Jeff. You know, Jeff is taking pictures of every single product that's going to be displayed on our new website in the new year. So that's an award well deserved. I'm now going to turn the time over to our Walnut Gate location for the Iron Man Award. The Iron Man Award is inspired by the Iron Man Triathlon. This 16 hour race is considered one of the most difficult sporting events in the world. At Meridian, the Iron Man Award pays tribute to individuals who demonstrate an added measure of effort, commitment, dedication, toughness, and resilience under pressure. And the nominees are... Stephen Harris, David Chen, Connor Gibbons, Kyle Smith, Samantha Bond, Harleen Singh, Andrew Sakara, Murray Redekop, Cole Dunn, and Gigi McDonald. And the winner is... Samantha Bond. Congratulations. Before we move on to our next award, I would like to take a moment and talk about an Ironman that works with us every single day. His name is Kerry Griffin, and he is the produce manager of our Maple Ridge location. In the summer, he was working in Tawasson. He was outside where he heard a car accident. He ran towards the car accident. 
And what happened was a pedestrian was pinned underneath the car. Now with the help of a few people around him, they actually lifted this car up off the ground. They were able to pull this gentleman to safety and he's going to be okay. But the heroic nature that Kerry showed that day was incredible, running towards the scene. So much so that the Delta Police actually gave him an Outstanding Citizen Award. Kerry, we are so honored to be working with you and thank you for working with us. It is time now for our final individual award for the evening. And this award is called the Ace of the Year Award. And for that, we'll turn it over to Nicholas at the Tawasson store. Hi, I'm Nick from Tawasson. I'm a customer service leader in the grocery department, and I've been working at Meridian for just over a year now. This year, I'm proud to present the Ace of the Year Award. Ace, short for Ambassador Customer Service, is a designation that describes us all. The Meridian Ace of the Year Award is a symbol of high praise for individuals who show high mystery shopper scores and exemplify our Meridian purpose. As you all know, our Meridian purpose is to give our customers the best possible experience. This year's nominees are... For this award, every one of you is a nominee. So the winner for this year's Meridian Ace of the Year Award is... Sarah McCarville. What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life. Deep connection. We're now on to the final award of the evening, which is the coveted Sirloin Cup. The Sirloin Cup is awarded to the store that has the highest mystery shop average for the year. And this year's winner is... North Vancouver! Yeah! So that brings us to the end of this evening's ceremony. So once again, congratulations to all the store finalists and nominees, and congratulations to our Academy Award winners. We wish you all a very Merry Christmas and hope that you enjoyed this night's event. Thank you. <laughs>